Hello and welcome to this week's Procrastacast. <laughs> this week we're going to talk about movie reboots and if they're a good thing or not. Hey. Hello everyone, welcome to this week's Procrastacast. I am Alex, at AlexH on Twitter. I'm Jared, at AlphaDude21. Uh, and we're talking movie reboots this week. Yeah, so this is a this is a big topic nowadays. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. everything coming out is a reboot, it seems like. Yeah. It's uh, uh, getting kind of ridiculous. Yeah. Um, some are good, some are bad. Mm-hmm. But that's what, that's what we're going to talk about, whether or not it's, it's like good for the industry. Yeah. Um... What are, what are your thoughts? Um, well, my quick answer is it really depends on it. Really depends on the series that they're rebooting, um, and the movie that they're rebooting. If it was originally really good or not, um, uh, I want to say yes and no. Maybe more leaning towards no because a lot of the reboots that I've seen have really sucked. Yeah, especially like a lot of the reboots that were they're rebooting a movie that was rated R. Yeah, and turning it into a PG thirteen movie. Yeah, see, I don't like that. That just takes away like that from everything that you liked about yeah, the movie. Yeah, I agree. Um, uh, like, and then you have some cases like where they're re. I don't know if it's. I don't know if you consider it a reboot, but um, they're they're redoing. And I just found this out recently. Uh, they're redoing Alien three and four. So Aliens one and two, great movies. Ridley mm-hmm. Scott. Then James Cameron came in and just wrecked it up, like fucking wrecked it, like, and, when, and it's a good thing. Um, and then Aliens three and four came out, worst, <laughs> the yeah, worst awful. movies. Um, but they're redoing them. They're redoing them. But they're not. They're, they're not. Uh, they're they're not like retelling the story. They're basically starting it too, and then they're making this. They're taking the story from there. Um, they're like, like relaunching the series, but. Ignoring the yeah, the and I guess you could say that's a reboot, yeah. Like yeah, so they're, rebo- they're rebooting the franchise, right? Right. Uh, they're keeping the canon right. of one and two, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and then just trashing everything else. Well, they keep an AVP. Is that still a thing? Alien vs Predator. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how they're gonna mix that in. I know that's kind of just like an off, like a one-off thing. But I'm sure they're gonna reboot it, <laughs> right? A two-off thing. Yeah, or a two-off thing. Yeah. <laughs> um, uh, well, so that I think counts as a reboot, but I think that's the way it should be done. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you're taking the good parts of a franchise and you're not getting rid of them. You're not changing them. Mm-hmm. You're just adding to them. Yeah. Um, now, when you do them over again, like Spider-Man, for example, mm-hmm. I don't think they did a very good job. I never even watched the other, the new ones. Uh, never they, watched. The it, see, Spider-Man. they were okay. Uh, they, they were, they were okay. Uh, they, you know, they were entertaining, but they, mm-hmm. I mean, they, they weren't very good. Like the first Spider-Man movie was awesome. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it did come out when I was a kid. So yeah, it helped. And then they just got worse as mm. they came out. Um, yeah, I don't know. I mean, we'll we'll d- define like a reboot because I know there's a. What, I mean, what what is it in comics? Like, so when, when in, I, I know uh, DC recently did New Fifty Two. Now they're not doing that anymore. Yeah, but well, was that but they're is that keeping considered? The canon, so right, 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 so right, right. Yes and no. So some of the canon they kept, some of it they didn't. Right, right. It's a that was more of a like. Is Let's that, make it easy for new people to get in, which yeah, is a, yeah. what a lot of people like for big series when they start over. Mm-hmm. It, that, that's the idea: is you draw in more fans, and that's a that's the definition of a reboot, that's, right? That's You're a, starting that's, that's over. A reboot. You're starting over. Gotcha, gotcha. Um, the thing about the new Fifty Two thing is they didn't totally start over. Mm-hmm. Like Green Lantern, nothing changed. Gotcha. It they just they just, kept, just took it just the tag kept off. Going, yeah, and it was at issue one again for the fifth time at that point. Yeah. Um, yeah. So they do that a lot. And I mean, a, a lot of it, a lot of times is due to a big major change in comics. Comics are a little bit different in this, I think, mm-hmm. but video games and video games, that's another topic we can talk about. Yeah. But, uh, video games and movies, usually they are changing everything. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, keeping the general idea and then taking yeah. it and going somewhere with yeah. it. Like Poltergeist. Mm-hmm. It's a new mm-hmm. Poltergeist movie. It does look cool. It looks awesome. But it's reboot. Yeah, and see, uh, see, I don't know. Like horror movies, completely different thing. I feel like apples, oranges, um, and uh, you know, those were very. Cl- I mean, a lot of those movies have like cult following. So I don't. Mm. I mean, I, 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 it really depends on the person. It really depends on the movie. Yeah, because there was the like, for me, I loved the remake, the first one, mm. uh, the remake for Halloween. 
Yeah, uh, yeah. The Rob Zombie. I think those were good. I think those were those good. Those were I didn't necessarily like the second one as much as I liked the old Halloween movies, yeah. but the first one was awesome. It was yeah. very different from the old ones. Mm-hmm. Not as campy, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but good. But like Texas Chainsaw Massacre, I didn't really necessarily like the... Yeah. I think, the, it's, the I think newer it, ones. it gets out of hand with horror movies because it's like... <laughs> You know what I mean? It's it, they're, they're not hard to. I don't feel like they're very hard to make. You know? Yeah. Um, and it just depends on how they do it. You know? Because, I mean, they may, they can make a remake of Texas Chain, but it won't hold bar with, you know, the the original one. Because yeah. you're, it, when you think about it, you're not going to think of the reboot. You're going to think of the original. Exactly. One. Same yeah. thing with The Exorcist. Same thing with mm-hmm. The Shining. You know, all of those movies. And the, you know, they they are rebooting them or they are remaking them. Uh, you know, with modern more modern effects. And, and whatnot, yeah. and that's what that's what's cool about them. But I feel like that's just there are some movies that I think deserve to be remade yeah. with modern like technology, but they need to be done right. They need to be held oh, to like the same standard, yeah, yeah. Uh, as they were when they were produced. But I feel like a lot of mm-hmm. them aren't, especially like like we were talking about earlier, the Radiant thing, mm-hmm. like Robocop. Did you see the re- reboot remake? Uh, no, I didn't. I, heard, I, did, I didn't hear it's it was PG very 13. good. It's not the same. What's the original Robocop rated R? Yeah. Oh, the fuck. dude gets destroyed, but you uh-huh. don't see that. Like you don't see the. I mean, in that one is pretty. Yeah, much so they added a bunch of effects to it. To yeah, make it was it look cool. There, I was like, oh, cool, they're doing a RoboCop movie. They can do all this cool stuff with like modern CGI, but mm-hmm. they did. But it's not the same yeah, feeling yeah. of. Well, I mean, violence in that movie. Yeah. Um, so, I mean, what do you think about it? I mean, like, so what is your like? If you had to, if I had to, if I'm holding a gun to you right now. What uh, reboots are they good? Are no. they good for no? No, because in thirty years, yeah, what I'm gonna hate to see is they reboot Lord of the Rings. Yeah, like they're yeah. like, oh, this this movie made millions of dollars because it's a, it's a money thing. Yeah, yeah that's it's all it is. It's a fucking it's, money it's thing. because there are people that are that will see it. That were kids when they saw these movies when they came out. Yeah, now they're adults and they, and they're like, oh, let's put these back in theaters and they're going to they're gonna take their kids and then yeah. every yeah. thirty years you're going to see this again. Yeah, and I completely disagree with that. It's totally a money thing, and I I don't want that. I want yeah. to remember these movies as they were. Yeah. Not see them remade in yeah. generally a really yeah. shitty fashion. And, and to uh, go back to the, the aliens topic that I was talking mm-hmm. about earlier, they're not redoing the story mm-hmm. for three and four. They're just taking it from two and, and, and they t- realize they screwed, there. like that yeah, those movies story sucked. was like got screwed up. Um, that, I mean, that's they're retconning it basically. Yeah, yeah. Well, like that's what you would do in comic books. They're mm-hmm. taking, hey, these first two are awesome. We're going to continue the story from there. We fucked up. Sorry. Let's do it. Let's keep yeah, going. Yeah. Uh, but like when you take a movie and you go, okay, we're retelling the exact same story. Yeah. Uh, yeah. See, I don't, I don't know. I don't. I don't, I don't. I don't like that. So is that? I mean, is that? Do you consider that a reboot? Yeah. When when they do that, because maybe so maybe Alien isn't a. There are certain movies I would love to see redone yeah. with modern technology, like mm-hmm. Never Ending Story. Yeah. You yeah. Can throw some good actors in there mm-hmm. and some cool CGI. That'd be awesome to see. But like, I don't need it. It's still a good movie. Yeah. Yeah. But like, I want the exact same story. I almost just want it like remastered, not really done differently at all. Yeah, yeah. Just remastered. I, I, it I just depends like on what you're into, I guess. Yeah. Because like part of me wants to, see, you know, I, 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 I love back the Back to the Future movies. Mm-hmm. Part of me wants to just see them. Like I just want to see what it would look like. <laughs> not, well, not that I would like it. Well, and see, they can do. Oh, and they editing. will. They can do. So. I know they're going to redo Back to the Future. Yeah. Uh, because he, what, one of these. It's supposed to be now that they're coming to the future, right? Yeah. This year? Yeah, the Cubs are supposed to win the World Series this year. Not going to happen. No. Um, they haven't won ever. They're not going to win ever. So, and that's one where they could go back and remaster it. They don't have to yeah. make a new movie. Yeah. I mean, with the, the way the technology is yeah. today, they can really... They can really blow as long as they don't yeah. do the George Lucas idea of remastering and, like, Just changing adding it, and changing uh, Outright things, changing it, yeah. Like, ch- literally changing scenes to make it fit. As long as you don't do that, as long as you just literally increase the the graphical quality, yeah, do it. Yeah, that'd be cool. I'd love to see a remastered Back to the Future because like mm-hmm. it'd be awesome looking. Yeah, I agree. But I don't want to see a movie without those characters. I don't want to see that movie without those characters. Yeah, and they can. Yeah. I mean, they're, now they have holograms and shit. So it's like, <laughs> I mean, if you've seen Tron, Tron Legacy or the, the whatever the, the most recent Tron movie. 
when the, mm. they they just redid Jeff Bridges, like right, like from the they, they brought back young Jeff Bridges. Yeah, and um, it didn't look that good. I mean, it didn't really look you very can tell. good. But I mean, when was that movie? Like five years ago. Yeah. Things so change. I mean, it's gonna be better. Um, yeah. So yeah, just I mean, whatever CG, whatever. It's definitely one of those. Like this is a topic that's I mean being discussed a lot now. But yeah, it is. It is hard to say. For sure, I don't want to see remakes because I mean I've watched a lot of them. I like. Yeah, I want to see them. I just I don't think they're. I don't think. I would I, rather. I, I, would I, rather I people, know what they're like. What's behind them? Yeah. So and they I, suck to me. Most of them. I would rather people spend their time and their like creative talents to come up with new Something ideas. New, like, yeah. We don't have enough new ideas coming out in film right now. It's just rebooting yeah. everything. Yeah, that's like, true. What we have coming from games is like amazing. Because people are, like, you get in small studios together and you're making some really creative stuff. We're yeah. not seeing that the same way we yeah. were 30 years ago in movies. Yeah. And game reboots are and game reboots are, are, are much different. I mean, because mm-hmm. a lot of the times they, they, they're really just making it better and I, and something I can play on, a, on, a, on a, or something yeah. recent. Yeah. Uh, um, there, I mean, the one example for a reboot, like a total reboot of a video game, not just an HD release, is like Tomb Raider. Tomb, yeah, the Tomb Raider. Yeah, and those were good. I, I, to, I the, the Tomb, Raiders Tomb Raider good. was good. Um, yeah, that um, was another one. Prince of Persia. Prince of Persia. Uh, uh, Thief uh, was a reboot. Not so good. No, that no, was not game. very good. But uh, it was a reboot. Um, <laughs> um, yeah. But yeah, I think I think we're still a little torn on this topic. Yeah, but I think you guys kind of saw our points. Like I mean, I think we, the overall is like, no, we don't. We, we know we don't. We don't. Like, we don't like but if them. it's done right, in, yeah, it and just, handled properly, it can be. It, it can just, be done. Okay, it depends on how. We would rather done. not see it. Put your talents towards something else, guys. Yeah. Um, let us know what you think. Sound off in the comments below. Do you want to see uh, movie reboots? Let us know. Um, like, share, subscribe. Tell your friends. Follow us on Twitter at TurboLoot Games. Follow him at lazy or Alex H at Alex H. I'm at Alpha D21. Um, let us know if you want us to talk about something else. Uh, we like doing these. Yeah, give us some idea for some talk- topics. Topics. Ta- topics. Topics. We'll uh, give you a shout out on one of our videos. Yeah. Um. And yeah. Yeah. See you next time. See you next time, guys. Later. <laughs> <laughs>